Welcome to Epsona for Salesforce. We are so excited that you have decided to choose us for your data management needs. In order to access our products, you will need to first install it in your Salesforce org. Once installed, your next step is to assign licenses to your users. As you can see here, Epsona for Salesforce is our base application. We have eight add-on products. Each product will need to be assigned separately. You can mix and match the add-ons as you would like. However, everyone in your organization who uses Epsona will need a base license assigned to them. In order to assign a base license to each of your users, you'll need to go into Salesforce, click the gear icon, choose setup, search for installed packages, choose manage licenses next to Epsona for Salesforce. Click add user, choose the users you'd like to add, click add, and you've added your users. If you have installed any of our other add-on products, you'll need to assign those licenses here as well. For example, Epsona dedupe and match, grids, et cetera. Our AppSona for Salesforce base package trial includes document and email merge and charts and dashboards. If you'd like to try these products as well, they can be assigned to users in our app. These two products are add-ons, so if you decide to purchase them in addition to the base app, you can do so. However, if you decide to purchase only the base app, they are not included. Next, let's add the AppSona tab so you can get into the app and assign the document and email merge and charts and dashboard licenses. In order to do that, you will want to go to the gear icon, click Setup. Enter App Manager in the Quick Find search box. Scroll down to the app that you're currently using. I'm in the Marketing app. Click the down arrow and choose Edit. This is where you can add or remove tabs. I already have the Epsona tab added. So I'm just gonna save. Now I should be able to access Epsona for Salesforce tab in my app, see it right here. Once the tab is added, you can easily access Epsona. Now let's assign those licenses. To do so, you will want to click Settings, Manage Licenses, Assigned Users. In order to assign licenses of the doc merge and charts and dashboards, you will want to click Edit and then the checkbox next to the users that you want to assign licenses to, then push Save. A few more things to note about the Manage License pop-up. This first tab is where you can see all of the products you have installed, as well as their expiration date. It is also where a Renew License button will appear when your trial is about to expire, as well as when you are about a month away from your renewal date. The second tab is where you can update your primary contact information. The primary contact is the individual who will receive email notifications letting them know how to purchase and renew licenses. If you have any questions or need further assistance, feel free to reach out to us anytime at support at epsona.com.